It's incredible. Kilauea eruption wows visitors in latest episode. Hawaii National Park Hawaii News Now, Episode 21 of Kilauea's ongoing eruption is now over, after another spectacular show Tuesday morning. The latest episode rumbled again at around 3 a.m. and fountains erupted from both vents just minutes later. Visitors flocked to the crater to catch a glimpse of the eruption. It's an amazing sight, it's unbelievable, said Ali Sagafi, who was visiting from California on his honeymoon. It's indescribable, because you see the power of the earth and the universe in front of your eyes, you can hear it. There's nothing like it. It's a chicken skin experience that offers more than just views too. As the fountain sometimes reaches heights of 650 feet, Pele's hair, a fine volcanic glass, floats across the park while rock fragments, known as tephra, fall from the sky. I heard fire running over my body and it felt it like rain, said Sagafi's wife, episode. Tina Sani. We were very close to the summit, so it rained rocks on us and we picked it up. Episode 21 was paused around 1.30 p.m. Tuesday, but even during the pause, the volcanic glass that had accumulated was still on the ground. Hawaii Volcanoes National Park officials expect more visitors in the coming days for Merry Monarch Week and have a message to keep away. If you're gonna dance and do the protocol of hokupu, etc., you might want to seriously consider protecting your skin at least wear shoes and don't take your sandals off, said HVNP public affairs specialist Jessica Farrakane. Pele's hair, which is on the ground here along the summit of Kilauea, is like little shards of glass, it's very uncomfortable, it's hard to get out. It can get in your eyes and irritate your skin. Kilauea's next series of eruptions is set to begin in December 2024. What better gift to give mom on Mother's Day than the beauty, the power, the awesomeness, the sheer awe of watching creation happen before her eyes again. You know, because she helped create you after all. The Big Island's Kilauea volcano didn't think so either and it provided the perfect opportunity, a lava fountain for mom. The 21st episode of sustained lava fountaining from the ongoing episodic eruption of Halimauma Crater in Kaluapele, the volcano's summit caldera within Hawaii Volcanoes National Park, erupted at 12.45 p.m. today, May 11th, from the north vent in the southwest part of the crater. The dome fed piston site five hours earlier, marking preliminary activity for the main event before growing into a sustained lava fountain. The Hawaiian Volcano Observatory reports that the fountain quickly grew into a 500-foot geyser of molten rock that erupted from the crater as a lava flow that covered about 10% to 20% of the crater floor about an hour later. The southern vent was not yet active, but after 2 p.m., live feeds showed what appeared to be small fountains erupting from the twin vents to the north. The sustained fountaining was accompanied by a rapid change from inflation to deflation at the summit, along with a rapid increase in tremor. The Uekahuna tilt meter recorded about 7 micro radians of inflation between the end of episode 20, around 10 p.m. on May 6, and the start of episode 21 of sustained fountaining. The low-level activity that preceded this eruptive phase was characterized by gas piston events at the northern vent that cycled from dome fountains and lava pools to vigorous back drainage. Each episode of Halimauma lava flow since the eruption began on December 23, 2024, has lasted from 4.5 hours to 8 days. 
The eruptions were separated by lulls and eruptive activity of less than a day to 12 days.